Hey, Matt Jackson. Hey, Gary. What's up? <laughs> it is first Wednesday, and it's the first. First day of 2020. First day of 2020. So I it's know. the first Wednesday. First Wednesday, the first of this new decade. Of the year. Wow, yep. all three of those And things. that means uh, a Volkswagen gathering at In-N-Out. In-N-Out hamburgers. Yes, so uh, I'm getting kind of hungry. Uh, fresh back from our trip. Let's go uh, see some Volkswagens tonight, man. Hopefully a lot of people turn out. The weather's decent. Yes, no traffic, so it should be fun. Yeah, January 1st. It's, a, it's not cold. No, it's not that cold. It's not hot. No. No, but it's going to be good. So uh, why don't you guys come with us? We're going to go to uh, In-N-Out tonight. It's going to be a lot of fun. And uh, let's look at some Volkswagen. Let's go. All right. Boom. Wait a minute. You're taking this? Yes, sir. First Volkswagen show on Rocky Vive in a very long time. Been a little busy around here after Big Ben that day. Scirocco made it. Is that if, thing licensed and registered? Hey, F can't, can't hear that, that one, Matt Jackson. What? What's up, VW Lifer? So we're here with Arnaldo. He's in a, we went to high school together back in the day. And, uh, yes. This is his awesome Volkswagen. You can tell them <laughs> about these wheels that you got here. All right, so these are the RSI Beetle wheels. They were a limited production run of 250 sets in the world because they only made 250 Beetles. They're the four motion all wheel drive six speed manual with the VR6 six speed, which this car has. So it's just this car with a bug body on it. And they were not produced in the US, only in Europe. And I believe a couple in Mexico. And I had to fly out to Canada to pick up these wheels. Okay, that okay, say that again. You flew to Canada <laughs> to get the wheels, to take the wheels back with you on the plane. Yes, I did. And <laughs> so it, you and really I, wanted these wheels. I really did want them. I hunted them down for three years. I've only seen three sets for sale. And whenever, these are NOS too. So they weren't even put on the car. Oh, wow. Yeah, wow. in the original Volkswagen box. And I talked to the guy in Canada. He shipped it in from Germany and he actually got a second set for himself. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, tell us what we're sitting in. You are sitting in a 1983. <laughs> it's a 1982 Vanagon. It is. It is. A Vanagon what? Westfine. Westy. And tell me, what powers this wonderful Vanagon? It is a diesel engine. Really? 1.6. 1.6. I saw that motor earlier. It was very impressive. It looked like something that I used to have in my Rabbit. But this one's better. I agree. Because it's in your Westy. <laughs> this isn't your first Volkswagen. This isn't my first. Which number is this one? It's probably four or five. Really? It's wow. my second Westie. Second Westie. Mm -hmm. What's your favorite one so far? Uh, this one. Yeah? Yeah. I like it. So uh, tell us a story on how you picked this up. I think it's a pretty, pretty unique story. Long story short, a yeah. friend needed a ride to Houston, drove her to Houston, came back and saw it on the side of the road at a consignment shop. And there it was, calling my name. It was, Alice, buy me. And the lady who was selling it needed the money, and I needed a one that people hadn't picked over yet so yeah. it's perfect well it is a it's a it's just really clean it's a great little van again westy and I'm, I'm just so excited for you to have it and i know you're going to be driving it all over the place and camping and enjoying the volkswagen life i am is that the plan that's the plan so what's what's your first upgrade that you want to do what uh, i mean i mean really truly it doesn't really need much i mean it's 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 super clean the main thing i want to do is the wheels and tires okay what do you want to do on that i just want to get the stock 
rims and the hubs and okay. then some knobby tires oh knobby tires huh perhaps some general grabbers possibly you might join the grabber mafia maybe yeah yeah i actually did a vanagon not too while, long ago vanagon west end put grabbers on there and it absolutely changed the whole just the demeanor it looked kind of eh, i'm a vanagon but you know mm -hmm. but now it was oh can i say that it's a Vanagon. <laughs> yeah, it's a motherfucker. I drive a motherfucking Vanagon. You can hear the four cylinders roar as I lay it on the goddamn floor. Hear me coming from a mile away. Striking fear in your heart, and I can hear you say, Shit, man, that's one sweet looking back. Vanagon. Can I say that? I'll you beat that. I'll beat that up. Okay. okay. So, anyway, um, so you're going to get tires and wheels. Right. And then, uh, then what else? I don't know. I may want to do solar and just really get into it. So, uh -huh. is we'll there a, is there a possibility that uh, in your future where you may just hit the road? There's a pretty have good you, possibility. Have you given that some? That's, I mean, now that you have this kind of this, that's been spinning around in my head. Yeah, because yeah. I mean, a lot of folks are really getting into to to, the, to that what they call it, the van life kind of thing. Why, what's the appeal? I don't think I'd want to do it long term, but just to be able to go travel and see friends and have a place to stay without getting a hotel. That's, not, that's the whole thing, right? Yeah. You, I think when you have a Westie, it's kind of like you, you're like a turtle. You carry your house on your back. There you go. You know? And so that's a really nice thing to have. You just bought this, like maybe a couple weeks ago, right? Right. Uh, does it have a name yet? Not yet. My other one was Colonel Mustard. Yeah, I remember. And it was, so this, was Colonel Mustard. It was the same, same color. color. Okay. Yeah. But it so. wasn't. It's not mustard. No. Why was it Colonel Mustard? I, I don't know. That. It's just because it's yellow. And but this I don't is. It's yeah. a cute name. Well, it's very cute, but mustard's really yellow. This isn't. Yeah, I don't. Have know you seen they're... mustard lately? I, I mean, like, you put it on your have, burgers and you. Have see... you seen Dijon mustard? No. Oh, mm. spicy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, look how. Look okay. how yeah. All right, so so we got to come up with a name. Maybe that uh, we could have some folks out there. Ooh, up. yeah, throw out yeah. some names. Yeah, Alice's Vanagon needs a name. And it can't be Daisy or anything cute. No, it needs to be no. It, it's going to be an off-road, so it needs gonna to have be, a yeah, tough name. Like Dirk. No. <laughs> Dirk. <laughs> Uh, Off-road dirt, dirt, uh, uh, dirt diggler. No. <laughs> no, I don't even know what that's from. It's from like a bad movie, isn't it? Or something? Probably. <laughs> <laughs> Matt Jackson told me all about it. <laughs> Since you you have this van again now, and you're, you're I mean you're kind of thinking about like maybe traveling a little bit. Also, do you is this going to be like your daily driver kind of thing too? Pretty it much. Is, yeah. it, this is your daily, isn't it? Yep. That's really awesome. Do you do you uh, do you enjoy the, the the Volkswagen life? I mean, like when you drive this around and all the looks and pe you can't put in your case diesel in it without people coming up to you and yeah, it's it's awesome. I love it. I actually filled it up the other day, and somebody was telling me about someone outside of San Antonio that has a bunch of them, and it was somebody that we all know here. Yeah. So yeah, it's like a little community. It it's is awesome. Isn't it? Yeah, it's a, it's great that, that we all have opportunities to to do the things we do, like tonight's first Wednesday, and and coming up just all the events that we have going on. I know everybody gets excited and camping events and shows and cruises we have lots of stuff coming up then uh, uh I'm, I'm so happy that you have a volkswagen to, to, that now you can park in the same parking lot with us I know. Would, alice was so funny she would never I'm, she would like it, she would just show up like did you show up on foot no my other car is way over here in the other parking lot because she didn't want to it's okay to you know but yeah. now you're like here yeah it's exciting i can drive up and be proud yeah i yeah. think it is it is well alice um thank you so much for letting us hang out in your as of yet unnamed 82 vanagon westy that's pale yellow thank you that's it's really nice diesel powered that's right. which is really cool and i'm, I'm anxious to see what uh, uh what what do you do with this i think when you start really putting your touches to it and everything like that i think it's gonna be really good. it's gonna be a nice ride it already is yeah it's so clean thank you you did it it was what what, when the, what we refer to as a goodbye thank you you did it and i think this one is a really good buy i'm really happy for you i feel really good about it well alice thanks for joining us tonight here on vw life at first wednesday at in and out the first wednesday of this decade thank you i appreciate that all right, all right. happy new year's happy new year's there you go Hey, Matt Jackson. Bye. Hey, how's it going? It goes. Hey, uh, the very first in and out first Wednesday of 2020. Yes, the year of the decade. The yes, day. the decade. It all started today. Uh, kind of a low turnout, but that's okay. Yeah. We had some low turnout? Friends. What are you talking about? We
we have yeah and when, whenever mark and axel here you know it's it's official yes yeah, yeah. so uh a good night we got to talk to alice got on her new westy man yes, it's yeah. a, a true uh a very unique westy the, the, the uh, 82 diesel yeah yeah so it's really cool and super clean yeah it's mint super clean so it's mint mint and so that's nice charlie showed up and uh in yeah. mark drove the notch i drove kennedy it's kind of a crazy night yep yep so we just appreciate you guys watching tonight and yes if you like what you see hit that subscribe button and leave us a comment yes and stay tuned for vw life books as 2020 is going to be there's a lot of stuff going on that's right we're, we're going to bring it to you we will bring it to you we don't know what it's going to be all of it it's just we kind of we wing this stuff yes a lot <laughs> <laughs> anyway thank you guys make sure you subscribe uh, tell your aunts tell your uncles tell everybody about vw life spread the word we're here for you the vw community this is what it's all we do this for everybody man we, this is what it's all about so thank you guys so much happy new year Later.